so for today's video I thought it would be fun and interesting for you guys to see what an entire night with a newborn baby looks like so I am exclusively breastfeeding our two-week-old little boy Grayson I had him two and a half weeks ago and right now he's currently waking up every two to three hours to feed so I'm going to show you guys what our nights typically look like so I just finished feeding him it's about 7 45 right now and I just put him down for his first like night stretch so I anticipate him to wake up around 11 o'clock, give or take. I don't know, we'll see when he ends up waking up. But I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoy these types of vlogs and I'll try to film more of them. I know we need to film an updated morning and nighttime routine. Now that Grayson is here, that is on my agenda, so I'll be sure to film that for you guys soon. So after I'm done nursing and burping him, I'll swaddle him up in his bassinet and it's usually hit or miss with him passing out right away or me needing to replace his binky a few times until he falls asleep. The bassinet he's sleeping in is the Snoo by The Happiest Baby and it's by far my number one must have baby item. It is pricey but they do have the option to rent it which is such an amazing idea. We're renting ours for three months and I'm so glad we decided to. It saved me in my sleep this time around. We're using the Hatch White Noise and Nightlight for him and I love it so much. You can change the color to whatever you want it to and it has a bunch of different noises to choose from. And you can also control everything from the app on your phone too which is super convenient. Ten forty four is when Grayson woke up for his second nursing session of the night. After I get him up out of the bassinet, I'll take him over to the changing pad on our dresser and change him into a fresh diaper. Grayson is a super efficient nurser and usually will drain my milk within 10 minutes or so. Around a week and a half after he was born is when he was able to nurse from both breasts. But in the meantime, when he's feeding from one side, I'll use the Hakka to catch my letdown so it doesn't go to waste in a breast pad. This is another must have and definitely recommend it if you plan on breastfeeding. In between nursing and burping, I always sneak in the countless kisses and cuddles from him. I could honestly do this all day. There's nothing better than newborn breath and staring into his eyes. Occasionally he will need another diaper change before I lay him back down to sleep and this was one of those times.
Grayson was the most active in my belly at around 11 o'clock at night, so this is usually the hardest time for me to try to get him back down to sleep. I usually have to replace his binky countless times until he falls back asleep. And then I can finally sleep until I'm woken up again at 3 in the morning. <laughs> I'll do the same thing as before, except this time I'm a lot more exhausted and usually end up nursing with my eyes closed. I also usually end up having to use the restroom to change my pad at least once in the middle of the night because I am still bleeding. Give me all your love, oh, cause I want you. Nursing on top of the insane postpartum night sweats causes me to become extremely thirsty, so I'm coming into the kitchen to fill up my cup of water and I'm adding my after ease drops to help with the post labor contractions. Look me in the eyes. That's all I need, and I'll be all right. I'll be right here. I swear that I'll stay here with you. Hold me closer. I wanna stay here with you. All that we have is each other now. Then I'm back to sleep again before getting woken up at 6 a.m. for Grayson's fourth feed. Tell me what, what you want to do, I'll do anything. As long as I can be here with you, everything's alright. 9 a.m. is when he woke up after I put him down at 6, so he's been pretty consistent at waking every three hours to nurse at night. And after I finish changing him into a fresh diaper, I'll nurse him again and then I'll get up for the day, but usually won't end up changing out of my PJs or looking any better than I do right now, but these sleepless nights covered in sweat and milk are all worth it for this cute guy. <laughs> 